Between Kana and Rum, a steep-sided scar cuts through the seabed. Retreating glaciers in the last ice age littered the channel with small boulder piles, rock walls and sediment, the building blocks for a network of specialised habitats. The shallower waters of this sound are relatively sheltered, creating ideal conditions for some creatures that would normally be found deeper. Water pollution, physical disturbance and loss of habitat can disrupt the delicate balance of life here, harming vulnerable animals like these northern feather stars. They're elegant creatures that can swim short distances by waving their feather-like arms up and down. This way, they can escape from predators and seek out the best spot to capture food particles that the current carries past. Deep, muddy plains harbour a network of underground tunnels, home to crustaceans, anemones and fish. This nephrop spends most of the day in his burrow. At night, he leaves to forage for food, but he will rarely travel far. A rich source of food for cod, haddock and skate, burrowed mud habitats are also trawled for nephrops by one of Scotland's most productive fisheries. It's a vital ecosystem for many. The sound is a murky world, and until recently, this bed of rare, fragile fan mussels lay undiscovered. They reproduce by spawning into the sea. The dense community here, the largest in the UK, means there's a good chance of fertilisation. But outside of Kana, where only scattered individuals have survived, their future is in doubt. <laughs>